A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. This is how the birth of Jesus Christ came about. When his mother Mary was betrothed to Joseph, but before they lived together, she was found with child through the Holy Spirit. Joseph, her husband, since he was a righteous man, yet unwilling to expose her to shame, decided to divorce her quietly. Such was his intention when, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary, your wife, into your home. For it is through the Holy Spirit that this child has been conceived in her. She will bear a son, and you are to name him Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to fulfill what the Lord had said through the prophet, Behold, the virgin shall be with child and bear a son, and they shall name him Emmanuel, which means God is with us. When Joseph awoke, he did as the angel of the Lord had commanded him and took his wife into his home. He had no relations with her until she bore a son, and he named him Jesus. The Gospel of the Lord Took his wife into his home Family histories are replete with dramas and surprises. My own sibling's history towards marriage was no exception. Each one had a particular script with twists and turns, yet ending more or less happily. The story of Joseph and Mary unto becoming a family shares the human element of possible hindrances and dilemmas. What perhaps saves the relationship in danger is Joseph's unfailing obedience to God's word, and of course, God's faithfulness to his promise that with God, nothing is impossible. Human calculations or readings of situations may not be dependable and secure, but God's constancy and faithfulness are. Are you going through some kind of dilemma now? Have you wrestled with it alone and humanly, or have you tried consulting God?